In the Nuke 13 series, we introduced the Hydra Viewer to allow artists to get a closer representation of their 3D scene inside the 3D viewer to that of the output of the scanline render. This work has been included in the new 3D system and you'll be able to continue using this improved viewport experience with the new system. As we have opted to support both the classic and new 3D systems in Nuke 14.0, we did have to make a choice as to which system benefited from the Hydra viewport as unfortunately it could not be a feature across both systems. With this in mind, we opted to support the Hydra viewport in the new 3D system and Nuke's classic 3D system will default to the original Nuke 3D viewport. While this will unfortunately mean users used to working with the new Hydra viewport in Nuke 13 will no longer have the same experience in Nuke 14 when working with classic 3D nodes, they will be able to benefit from the Hydra viewer in the new 3D system as well as the new addition of support for subdivision surfaces when importing geometry. Now, when you import geometry into the new 3D system, you can see that the surfaces benefit from subdivisions allowing for a higher fidelity output.